Hey everyone and welcome to today's episode of Daily Scuba News. A tragic accident has led to the deaths of three scuba divers and has sparked fresh calls for street sentences and penalties for blast fishing. Currently local police have described Bajau or Sea Gypsies as suspects in the recent alleged murder of a Chinese couple and their local instructor in, the Born in Borneo after a suspected explosion by illegal blast fishing. So for those of you who don't know what blast fishing is, it's the use of a small underwater explosion to stun or kill schools of fish for quick and easy collection. So this practice can be, of course, very damaging to the surrounding ecosystem, as the explosion will often destroy the underlying habitats, such as the coral reefs. Uh, the frequently improvised nature of the explosive as well basically means danger for the fishermen, because if something goes wrong with an explosion, then everybody loses. And unfortunately, this is exactly what happens to the couple and the instructor. The police were told by the boat handler and another guide who did not go on the dive that they had dropped the divers off at around 2.30 in the afternoon after informing them to head to a nearby jetty whilst they went to collect some fresh cylinders. After not arriving back within a reasonable time, they went to check on the divers to find bubbles at the surface and a number of dead fish. So it was reported that through the clear water, the boatmen could see the divers on the seabed at a depth of just six meters, but they were not moving. Uh, once they had recovered the divers from the seabed, they were said to have been unmarked, but the lenses of their masks were cracked. Investigations and post-mortem examinations are being carried out to see if they can confirm if barotrauma is the cause of death. Well, the Bajau around the Malaysian island, two vessels within the vicinity said that they heard no detonations. Fishing boat crews are being hunted by local police on suspicion of the murder and the Sabah chief minister has asked locals who most likely know those reasonable to come forward. Following this incident, the, the culture and environmental minister, Datuk Christina Liu, uh, has called for stricter sentences to be imposed on anyone found guilty of blast fishing activities. Yeah, so this practice seems to be rampant across the area, and to be honest, it really does need to stop. Not only for the environmental impact, but for these potential accidents. If you're diving in the area, then definitely use an SMB so that others know that you are in the water and exactly where you are. Uh, as always, our thoughts are with the friends and families of those who have been lost.